Welcome to my Legend of Zelda Female Link Makeup Tutorial by Alexa Paletti. Start with a clean face and a cute Link themed outfit. Then we will add blue circle lenses to match Link's blue eyes. Next we will do our base makeup. I start with concealer around my eyes and then using clean hands I massage foundation into my skin. Then I use powder to set my foundation, then a primer to prep my eyelids for eyeshadow. Next we will use a white eyeshadow to brighten the inner corner and underneath our eyelids. We are going to use natural tones on the eyes since Link is from the forest. So let's add a copper eyeshadow to the outer half of our lids. Then we'll use a dark brown eyeshadow on the outer edge of our eyes and along the crease. I bring it down a little under my eyes too to help shape my eyes. Then we'll use a white eyeshadow as a highlight on our brow bone. Now it's time for eyeliner. I use a liquid liner, but you can use whichever kind of liner you're best at making clean lines with. Then we'll use an inner rim brightener on our waterline. You can use white or beige or gold or whatever your pretty little heart desires. Then we'll use dark brown eyeshadow on an angled brush underneath our eyes to mimic bottom eyeliner. Now we'll add mascara to our lashes. Then I'm going to use a brown eyeshadow to fill in my eyebrows. Time for blush and contouring. Make sure you hit your cheeks, your temples, and around your chin. None of my looks are complete without Dalux lashes. These are Dalux number 6 Whiplash Attack. Put some glue on the band and wait about 20 to 30 seconds for it to get tacky. Place the lash as close as you can to your natural lash line. I like to lightly dampen a q-tip and then press along the lash line to make sure that my lashes are on securely. Now our eye makeup is complete. Well, it's about that time. Goodbye t-shirt! Hello cosplay! One of Link's most consistent and recognizable traits is his cute blonde hair. So it's time to shove all of my black hair up into a wig cap. Link is Hylian, a race that looks mostly human but has long pointed ears like an elf. I'm going to use spirit gum to attach my prosthetic cosplay ears to bring this distinct Hylian feature to my cosplay. Slide the prosthetic over your ear and hold the connection points until they're dry. If you don't have spirit gum, you can use eyelash glue to attach the ears, but spirit gum is just a little more secure if you're going to spend a long day at a convention or something like that. My wig is from the Cosplay Wigs USA Princely Linden collection. I love this collection so much. Not only is it my favorite boy style wig because the cut and layers are perfect, but because the collection is named after Linden Valentine, an amazing cosplayer and one of my best friends. Isn't it so cute? Now I just need to finish putting on the rest of my outfit.
Don't forget to add lipstick once everything else is done. Here is my finished link transformation. I know Link doesn't wear makeup, especially not like this, but I think one of the fun things about gender bending in cosplay is being able to use your imagination to elaborate on an existing character. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. I'll see you next time. Please don't forget to subscribe. Bye!